Understanding Nightmare Alley, a guide to English phrases. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore an intriguing phrase, Nightmare Alley. This phrase is not only vivid but also packed with meaning, and understanding it can enhance your English comprehension skills. So, let's dive in. Nightmare Alley is a metaphorical phrase in English. It describes a situation or a series of events that are extremely troubling or difficult, akin to experiencing a nightmare. The word, alley, suggests a narrow, confined space, adding to the feeling of being trapped or overwhelmed. This phrase can be used to describe personal experiences, professional scenarios, or even global events that are particularly distressing. The origins of Nightmare Alley are not clear-cut, but it's believed to have emerged in the 20th century, possibly from literature or cinema. The phrase is used in both formal and informal contexts. In literature, it might appear to describe a character's challenging journey. In everyday conversation, someone might say, I've been down Nightmare Alley with this project, to express their frustration or difficulty. 1. After losing his job and then his house, John felt like he was walking down Nightmare Alley. 2. The team's project hit a Nightmare Alley when the funding was cut abruptly. 3. Her journey through illness was nothing short of Nightmare Alley, but she emerged stronger. Similar phrases include, down the rabbit hole, or in a tight spot. While these phrases convey a sense of difficulty, Nightmare Alley specifically emphasizes a series of distressing or frightening experiences. Nightmare Alley has been used in various cultural contexts, including the title of a novel and a film. These references can give deeper insights into the emotional resonance of the phrase in popular culture. We hope this explanation helps you understand the phrase, Nightmare Alley, better. Remember, language is not just about words, it's about the stories and emotions they convey. Keep learning and exploring, and you'll find that English is full of fascinating expressions like this one. Until next time, happy learning!